U.S. midfielder Lindsey Horan now joining us live from Leon. Moments from practice as well, so we appreciate her joining us to get her reaction. All right, so we've seen this draw. You know you're going to open with Vietnam. You know you're going to have a World Cup final rematch with the Netherlands in the second game. Early reactions, is it starting to get real for you? The World Cup's coming up. Yeah, obviously today is a, a good day. This is this is exciting. Um, you know, I, I obviously look at Netherlands for the for the second game and, you know, a little rematch there, but also knowing two of my teammates that I'll be playing against. And, yeah, it's just – it's exciting. And it's a very good team, uh, one that's developing a lot and, you know, has changed a lot over the last uh, two years or so. And then an opening game against Vietnam, I think that's great for us to get us going in the tournament. And, yeah, just uh, overall – very excited. Well, Lindsay, you look at the competitiveness of the World Cup. You know, we haven't seen it at this stage ever before. You guys are coming off of, of perhaps <clears throat> um, a difficult European tour in those last two games. When you look at where this team needs to go and where the women's game is going in terms of evolution of style, system, adaptability, do you think that the U.S. needs to be a bit more flexible and flex in and out of different systems? Yeah, you know, I think... I think we have a lot of work to do in the next year. Um, we obviously come off of these two games against England and Spain, and you see the competitiveness, you see the game changing and, and how these teams are evolving. And, and you know, we lost two games. And, of course, you can talk about all the players that we're missing and, and whatnot, but we need to be better. Uh, we need to learn and grow from these. And even without certain players on the on the field, we, we have to adapt and, and, you know, develop this style that we're going to go in and play in the, the World Cup. So... Hopefully, uh, going to improve a lot in the next year, and you know we have a lot of a lot of growing to do. Lindsay, this group is a lot younger than 2019. More inexperienced players playing in their first ever World Cup. What kind of conversations are you and other leaders on the team having in preparation towards the World Cup? Yeah, honestly, some of these younger players, you <laughs> you don't really think like they're they're that young. You have like. Sophia Smith, Trinity Rodman, players that have been playing in the league for the, you know, past two seasons and, and doing really well. And, you know, they're mature and, and they're growing and, and they're coming in and starting so many games with the national team. You know, this is exciting for them. Um, but, you know, you're going into a major tournament and for them to see what we what we kind of had to deal with against Spain and England was was huge. And I think, you know, that kind of sets the, the tone for what the World Cup's going to be like. So, Again, I'm really excited for them. I think they're going to be amazing um, going into this year and, and this World Cup. So we'll see, we'll see what this brings. You've got a schedule. You've got a roadmap. The World Cup's on the horizon, but you've got practice this morning. So, Lindsay, we really appreciate you giving us <laughs> a few Go change. Minutes. Good luck rest of the day. Yeah, thank we'll you. see you down under. Bye, Lindsay. Appreciate Thanks, you guys. Lindsay.